What's up guys, so in today's video I'm doing something a little different. Now before I start this video I'd just like to say one thing, I'm not being paid to say any of this. Also I get requests to do videos all the time, I get app review requests all the time, I get uh, requests to do advertising a lot, and I'm not going to do it if I don't like the app or what they're supporting or what they're promoting. Uh, unless I think you guys will like. But when this company called Camcord contacted me and told me a little bit about their service that's actually built into iOS, I thought that was a really cool thing and I thought it had some great potential. So that's what today's video is about. I'm going to be demoing a service called Camcord. And the best part about this is it's completely free. So let's get started with the actual video. Alright, so we got my iPhone here. So let me go ahead and unlock it here. And the app I'm actually going to be using to demo this is Base Jumper, which actually is supported with this. I called it. Jeez, that is loud. All right, so I called it a service in the last clip you saw, but it's really more of kind of like a feature, not really a service because they're not doing anything for you. So this is not whatsoever a app review of the app that I'm using. This is just a thing I want to use to demo Camcord. So in order to get Camcord to work, you're going to have to go into options in this particular game and go to gameplay. And as you can see, when I tap that, it switches the recording from on to off or from off to on. You're gonna wanna make sure that's on if you want uh, to actually have this work. So we're gonna do new jump here. I'm gonna show you exactly what this does. I'm not very far in this game. I'm not very good at it, so don't judge. Um, so let's go ahead, let's do the hardest one. Let, why not? We'll do the one I haven't played yet. See how bad I can do. So what uh, the camcorder is actually doing right now is recording all my gameplay while I play. So I'll go right there, boom. And the objective is this game is try to land in a certain area. So go ahead and tap again, and we'll get my parachute out. And this is going to take a while, so I'll go ahead and just cut this clip. Almost there. Go. Okay. Boom. Okay, so I did it right. So now what we're going to do is we're actually going to not rate that, because I don't want to. And we're going we're gonna to be able to view the replay. So let's go ahead and click this button here. And all this was recorded via camcord, which is built into the actual app. So you can see me jumping here. And then I deploy my parachute. Eventually. Eventually. Okay, good. And then we're going to stop there because I don't want to watch me fall for 10 hours. And then what you can do is you can actually share it uh, with certain services. So you can share it on Facebook, you can share it on Twitter, and you can directly upload it to YouTube. You can also email it. You can also change these settings here. So we can go in and we can sign into our Facebook, our Twitter, and our YouTube. Actually, I don't see Twitter on there, but I think it was on there before. I'm not sure why it's on, not on there now. I must have pressed something. But as you can see, it's powered by Camcord in the bottom down here. Now... A few things I wish this app did do that it doesn't do, which I'll talk a little bit more about later, is that it doesn't show your fingers on the screen and it can't record like multiple levels. So for example here, if I do this exactly again, I'll go ahead and just, I'll just die here. Actually I think you have to beat the level in order for it to record, we'll find out. So I'll go ahead and die here. And then we can view the replay, so luckily it did so it, but as you guys can see now, it's just this level, it's not my previous level. I would like a way to combine all the levels, so instead of uploading a 10 second video to YouTube, you could upload a 1 to 10 minute video of YouTube, uh, of you beating all the levels. I wish that would be integrated in the app. So again guys, this is in no way an app review for this app, this is a kind of like a demo of Camcord. I think this thing has a very good potential of being a very cool feature in apps and I hope that more developers will incorporate it in the actual apps. Now onto the things that I wish Camcord did. I wish Camcord had a feature where you could see where you touch on the screen. So have like a translucent kind of fingerprint Esh thing that when you like replay the video you could see where you were actually tapping on the screen this would be a great feature to have so that people who are watching the video could see where you're tapping on the screen and you could also like add a setting into it so where you could turn it off so if you didn't want it on or turn it on if you do want it on just something that would be nice to add and I know I did a Skype call with Camcord and we actually talked about that so hopefully in the future they will incorporate that. Now I also wish, and I said this in the actual video here, but I wish they had a way to combine all the videos together. So for example, if I did 10 levels and let's say they were roughly 20 seconds each, I wish there was a way to combine the 10 videos that were recorded into one big video. I did not see an option to do that uh, while I was using Camcord and it's kind of annoying to have to upload 10 second or 20 second videos to YouTube when you could just combine them all into one big video. 
Now I want to throw out one more idea here before I end the video and that's to create an actual computer application of Camcord. And now the reason I'm saying this is because Camcord has to be incorporated into the apps in order for it to be used. Camcord does not work with every app, it doesn't work with Angry Birds and stuff like that. The uh, developers of the app I guess have to get in contact with Camcord somehow or vice versa and they have to actually like put the code into the app or at least that's what I'm assuming. I'm not a coder or anything so I don't know but that's what I would assume. So in other words, what I'm trying to say is Camcord has to be integrated with the app in order for it to work. So a way around this, which would be nice, and this is again my crazy idea, is to create an app for the Mac and PC. And basically what this would allow you to do is completely record your iPhone via AirPlay or something uh, just from your computer. The application I currently use to record my iPhone uh, on my computer doesn't allow you to see the tapping on the screen and it's also very laggy. So uh, this is just a completely crazy idea and I'm not sure if Camcord would even think about doing this but it's just a suggestion. But other than those two to three things I think Camcord has some very very good potential. If you're someone who wants to record your gameplays and upload them to YouTube, this is a pretty good way to do it. If you want to record every single level of you beating Base Jumper and then upload it to YouTube, you can do it with this app. But otherwise, that's going to do it, guys. Let me know what you thought about Camcord down in the comments below. Camcord, if you're watching this, thanks for contacting me. I really do think your uh, feature in the apps have some good potential. I think if you guys could do a few other things, it could be very good and get it incorporated with more apps. Camcord has some very good potential. And like I said in the beginning of the video, I don't make videos on stuff I don't think is interesting or I don't think you guys will like. This is one of the things I thought was interesting and think that it has some, again, good potential. That's the big word in this video, potential, potential. I will leave a link in the description below which will forward to my website where you can see the list of all the iOS apps that currently support Camcord. And then you can go to that page and you can download the apps that support Camcord and maybe upload them to YouTube. And if you do upload them to YouTube, go ahead and tweet the video at me. I'm at I apply tech on Twitter. Otherwise, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching the video. I'll see you in my next one. If you're new to the channel, I put out new tech videos every week, so be sure to subscribe. And that's it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.